hey you guys welcome back it's ashley so it has been a while you guys it's been about three weeks since i've uploaded a video and i'm so so sorry okay but i have a video for you guys today it's gonna be a sephora haul like a little mini sephora haul and then i'm gonna be showing you guys some um things that i got from a small business you guys know i like to try to support small businesses and i think you guys should too so i had somebody from Instagram, a really beautiful girl. She sent me some of her stuff um, to review and to give her some feedback. So I'm gonna be opening that up today. And then I also have something else from another woman. Um, she's actually a friend of me and my husband's. And um, anyways, I'm, I'm gonna be reviewing and talking about her product as well. But first we're gonna go into the Sephora haul. It's just like a little mini Sephora haul. And then I'm gonna be talking about their products for you guys. So this is kind of like a Sephora haul slash small business okay so anyways you guys how have you been so like i said it's been three weeks i've been slacking i'm so sorry for everybody that's new thank you so much for joining me and for all my um you know day one people what's up how you doing girl or or boy <laughs> um anyways so i have this bag from sephora i got this last weekend and i've been saving it so i can make this video for you guys since i haven't been putting out content i'm so sorry i know um by the way i'm trying something new on my lips today so if it's a little dark or a little extreme okay don't hate me i'm just trying to try new things okay so anyway let's go ahead and get into it like i said it's not too much stuff in here but it's enough okay so i got this all last weekend so i'm gonna just pull out stuff randomly so we got my girl fenty right here you guys, I love Fenty's products. Like, Rihanna, oh my gosh, you guys. She was made to make makeup. Like, I know she's beautiful and I know she has a great voice. But she was made to make makeup because her stuff is so amazing. So, I'm actually wearing this today. I did get into it a little bit this weekend, like, all my makeup. And then I put it back in the box so I could do this video for you guys. Um, so, anyways, look how pretty. Okay, my fingerprints are getting on it. Look how pretty the packaging is, okay? Like, um, this too. Like, all of the packaging is so beautiful. Oops. Okay, so the name of this highlighter is called Rose Rave. Let me show you guys. This is so nice. I love how big the mirror is, by the way. But, oh my gosh, this just does not do it justice. It's like kind of like a rosy gold color. And I thought it would be really pretty on my skin since I'm so damn pale. But yeah, so I got this highlight from Fenty. It's so beautiful. I've had this stuff just sitting in this bag for a week now so I can do this video for you guys. So now I could actually put it up onto my makeup table. That's a complete mess, by the way. Okay, the next thing, which I also got into because my other one ran out, is this Urban Decay De Slick Oil Control Makeup Setting Spray. I love this setting spray. This is my third bottle now. I took a break from it after the first bottle and then I purchased it again. I'll show you. And um, I used it until it was freaking empty. So. I really love it. That's why I got another one. I'm going to try this new thing where if I find things I like, instead of trying to be like, oh, I can find something better. I need to just stay, stick with it. Like if I find something I like, why do I try to switch it up? I don't understand myself. But anyways, so this is a really good setting spray. If you guys are interested in any, in a setting spray, if you have like kind of oily skin or combination skin like me, this is a really great setting spray. Like I said, it's my third bottle. Okay, next thing I am pulling out is this Huda Booty, <laughs> Huda Beauty, not booty, um, lip contour. And this is actually what I'm wearing on my lips today. Um, it's kind of messy, I feel like, but it, it's like a brownish red. It's super pretty. I love this color on women. It's just, it's hard to pull off. I feel like it's hard to pull off for pale skin. But what I did is I just lined my lips with it. And then, um, I line my lips with it and then I just put um, lip gloss in the middle. So that's kind of what I'm working with today. Let me know if you guys like it. If you hate it, you could also let me know, but you know, it might hurt my feelings a little bit. But anyways, yeah, I got this lip liner. It's super pretty. And the next thing I got is, what is this? Makeup Refreshing Spray by Fenty as well. Um, look how cute this is. So this is, I guess it's supposed to... Like, you know how sometimes you put on your makeup, it looks great, and then a few hours later, it'll start to look like, ugh, like maybe I need to touch it up. That's what this is for. So you spray this on, like, you know, after a few hours of wearing your makeup, and it's supposed to just refresh your makeup. So I got that because I'm always touching up my makeup on the weekends because I'm like, I'll put it on in the beginning of the day, and then I want to make videos or make content on my TikTok or whatever towards the end of the day, and my makeup's just a mess. So I would... 
I thought this would be like a really great option for me. So I got that. I have not used this yet. But like I said, her, her products are super amazing. So I feel like it's going to be great. Okay, this, you guys, I didn't realize I got the small one. But this is the Fenty Beauty um, Pro Filter Hydrating Primer. And this is in the one Soft Silk because she has three different ones. This is the one I really like. Um, this is my second bottle. I had the big bottle. I think it, I already threw it away. But I had the big bottle and I really needed some more because I ran out and I love it. This is my favorite primer. I'm probably going to stick with this for a long time. Um, the other bottle's much bigger. I didn't realize I grabbed the small one. I'm so dumb. But anyways, I got this. This is super amazing. Um, got some more stuff from Fenty. This might be the last thing from her. So I haven't tried this yet. I've never tried it before. I've never heard of it before. But this is the blotting powder, okay? So the reason why I got this is because, like I said, I tend to touch up my makeup a lot during the day because my skin starts to get oily and it starts to show through my makeup. So I thought this would be perfect because instead of me blotting on or putting on more powder throughout the day and making my face look more cakey, I thought this would be like a better option. Um, so let me show you this really quick. It has a mirror. So here's the powder and I guess you're supposed to use this to blot it. This is the first time I'm opening it. Um, it has like a little safety. There we go. Let me take that off. So that's what it looks like. It's a, like a very, very soft powder. Let me like put it on my chin really quick. So you see how my chin like a tiny bit oily right now? And then it just like clears that oil right up. That's super awesome. Okay, so I got that. That's my first time ever using it. I like the packaging. It's like very classy. So, oh my gosh, I need to clear up my makeup table. I need to clean it. It's a freaking mess. I would show you guys, but I'd be embarrassed. Um, what else do I have? Um, I also got this, which I used today. It's the, um, what is this brand again? Benefit. That's what it is. It's the Be Benefit California. Um, and anyways, it's just a blush. So it's like an orangey, peachy, pinkish. Well, it's more like a peach. It's a blush. And I thought this would be really pretty on my skin. I'm wearing it today. It's a very light blush, which I actually appreciate. Because sometimes blushes can just be way too bright. And this is more of like one that you could actually build up. And I also have, I didn't just get this. I got this uh, a while ago, but I haven't really used it. The bronzer, but honestly, this is a little too dark for my face. So I don't really use it. This is my all-time favorite bronzer, especially if you're very pale like me. They have light, medium, and dark, and I get mine in light. Anyways, yeah, I thought this was super pretty. Like I said, I used it today and, damn it. Okay, well, I don't need that anyways. I used that today. Very pretty. And then I think this is the last makeup product. Yeah. Right? Yeah, this is the last makeup product, okay? So I got this. I have not opened this yet. I have not tried it yet. This is in this is the brand Too Faced. It's called Peach Bloom Color Blossoming Lip Blom Lip Balm Infused with Peach and Sweet Fig Milk. Um, this is in the color Raspberry Flush raspberry flush so i just like this because i like to find things that i can wear for work that are hydrating and that add a little color to my lips because my natural lip color is very pale it basically looks like my skin so i like to find things that i can wear that are that's not really dramatic that i could put on for work so i got this like i said i've never used it oh look how cute so um i don't know if you oh there you go yeah you can see it so it's like a little it's like a glossy light pink which i feel like it's gonna be really pretty to wear um like i said when i'm going to work or maybe when i want my makeup to like really look really light got that and by the way i'm so sorry i don't remember the prices to all this i know fenty's products always range between like 20 and 30 dollars and then um i got two more things to show you guys okay so this hopefully that was it i've i've accidentally thrown away new makeup before because i left it in the bag so Ooh, one second all right you guys, you guys, I'm so excited about this product because, hold on, let me find my old one. Ooh, my makeup's looking a little rough up close like that. Okay, anyways, I had gotten a sample of this from Sephora because they give out birthday gifts. So if I went there and they're like, oh, you never picked up your birthday gift. And they let me pick out a few different things. And they had the bum bum cream and I got like a little tiny sample size. It was super tiny. And I freaking fell in love with it. The It smelled amazing like literally better than almost everything anything i've ever smelled okay i know that's like extreme but i'm so serious so anyways i went ahead and got the huge one okay i think this was like 25 30 dollars you guys i'm telling you this smells amazing i don't even know if it works well i don't know if it's hydrating i don't know if it helps stretch marks 
all I know is it smells so freaking good. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this has like a like a vanilla almond smell. I don't know if you guys are into that. I am, I love really sweet smells, but it's called the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. And they have this one, and they also have one that's in a, it's in a green bottle, which also smells good, but I like this one better. So I have not even used this yet. I've, I used my small one until I ran out, but this, you guys, is super amazing. So like I said, if you're looking for a lotion that smells really nice, definitely pick up that. Also, you guys, I got a little sample. When you go to Sephora, they always give you like little sample stuff when you when you go to purchase your, your things, I think anyways. Unless, I don't know if it's like if you have to have a big purchase or what, but anyways, they always give me samples, but I always have big purchases because, you know, your girl likes makeup. But this is called Tory Burch, and they, I guess it's like one of their first perfumes. I don't know. That's what I said on the packaging. Maybe I'm wrong. It smells so amazing, you guys. I didn't buy this, obviously. It's a sample, but I'm going to go back and buy this. My husband loves it. Like I said, it's called Tory Birch, okay? Super good. Let me show you what the actual bottle looks like. So this is what it came in, Tory Birch, and it says my first fragrance. So I don't know if that's like the first one they made, but look, that's what the bottle looks like, okay? It smells so good, you guys. Ladies or men, if you're looking for a really nice perfume, this is really, really good. Like I said, my husband fell in love with it when I, sp I sprayed it on like after we got out of Sephora and he was like, what is that? That smells so good. So I'm gonna go back and get the full size eventually. I don't know how much it was though. It might be like a hundred dollars. Okay, I'm talking like a million miles an hour. Okay, so the next thing you guys we're gonna get into is the small business items. Okay, so I got this really cute little package right here. Um, so this is called um, Mommy's Night In, okay? And it, this woman on... Instagram who I've been following and she's been following me for a while. She reached out to me and she said, hey, I have this small business I'm working on. I've worked really hard. If I send you something, um, would you try it for me? And I was like, of course, you know, she didn't ask me to make the video, but um, I definitely don't mind supporting and helping out small businesses. I would want somebody to do that for me if I had a small business as well, you know? So anyways, it has this little sticker on it that says, thank you for supporting my small business. Super cute. Love the packaging. And, um, I don't have, I don't know what's all in here, but I knew, I do know that she was making bath bombs. Okay, so here's what it looks like on the inside. It looks like it's, you know, like a Christmas gift or something, super cute. So let's see, this is, so I guess they're all bath bombs. So this is like little clovers, that's so cute. So um, they, they all, they look like they all have that sticker on it that says thank you for supporting a small business. And then we got here a really big bath bomb, so. I'm excited to try those out. What is this? Oh, that's so cute. Look, it's a little um, leprechaun. What do you call these? It's like a pot, a pot of gold. Um, so there's that. That's so cute. So I believe these are all, these are all bath bombs. And then, oh, this is for, uh, I, I forgot it's March, we're in March. How cute. And then she has, she put some socks in there, aw. Okay, and then um, what else? I see something else in here. Oh yeah, here's some more little mini bath bombs. These are so precious. Got a little green bracelet in there that says good luck. I'm gonna give this to my daughter. She's gonna love it. And what is this? <laughs> Four leaf clover, good luck. And then it looks like the last thing that's in here. Oh, there's another bracelet. Definitely gonna give these to my daughter. She's gonna love that. I got a, ooh, a hand sanitizer. I love hand sanitizers, you guys. I have them all over my house. I have them in my cars. This is cute, a little unicorn. But yeah, that's what I got in here, you guys. Like I said, it's she makes bath bombs and I'm gonna link all her stuff in the description down below. If you guys are interested, thank you so much, girl, for sending this to me. Um, like I said, it's called Mommy's Night In, but I will link everything below. Okay, and the last thing I have is called um divine beauty and it is a cuticle oil which i need desperately i constantly pick at my cuticles i don't want to show you guys because it's super gross but um this is from a friend of me and my husband's um this really amazing lady her and her husband are her whole family is friends of mine and my husband's and um, i purchased this from her i think it was 14.99 and like I said, I will link it down below as well. If you're if you're interested in a cuticle cream, this is really amazing. It's super soft. It smells so good. It smells so amazing. 
so anyways it just has this little what do you call this i forget what you call this i'm so bad with stuff like this but you just take that and then rub it on your cuticles and then you're just gonna keep smelling it like i like using it just because i could keep smelling it throughout the day it's it's super super nice super soft like i said uh she has a etsy an etsy account i believe that's what it's called and I will link it down below if you guys are interested in a cuticle cream and if you're interested, uh, not a cuticle cream, a cuticle oil. And if you're interested in just supporting a small business, um, yeah, I will link everything down below. Thank you so much for um, making great products. You know, both these ladies are making great products and um, I, love, I love supporting small businesses. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you are interested in these uh, any of these items, I will link it down below. I love you guys. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.